Now the recording is going. Oh, baby! You know what time it is. Skip to the next level because we already spent uh, half an hour here. Level 24. What in the world is this stuff? I feel like I'm in a storage locker. I've got like two hours today. Maybe an hour and a half. And then I gotta, I gotta go. I, oh, oh, I went the wrong way, didn't I? <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> ah! The wall. Reminds me of high school hallway. It would. Me as well, if it wasn't for the gravel floor and the metal paneling on the walls. I don't remember what this level was supposed- was actually was. Bob is back. Yep, it's Blob- it's Blobbert. Thanks, Bob. Back to you, Bob. True thing, Sandra. Hello? Why is there? Oh no. Containment's been breached. Ah! I'm okay. Your high school wasn't like this? Uh, I mean, kinda. We were too poor to afford metal. It was just made of asbestos. How are you, random user? Get ducked. Oh my god! Can't catch me. <laughs> I'm fine. That's good to hear. In Greece, they are different, I imagine. Greece is like a whole different country. We don't have lockers. We did, but I never used mine because I was a weirdo and I carried all of my books in a bag. Hello? Oh, hey! No wonder it suddenly got very, very dark. 24 is the moon and there's a moon base, but I don't know. Well, what level are we on? We're on 24. It ducked. It ducked. Maybe this is supposed to be a moon base? It'd be super sick if we like found a door out of out of it if there is if this is. And you just wander around on the moon. To the moon! And you walk the moon and you walk the moon. High five, slap. Ow. It's hard to slap my cheek for a for a skin sound effect. Ah! Hello? Whenever you have headphones on, it makes your cheek very small. Howdy. Are you the hall monitor? I'm going to go pee without your permission! Catch him! It's the rogue pisser! You'll never take me alive, nerd. What happens if you get close to the hands? They despawn and you take damage. They slap you. Like every other creature in this game. There are unfortunately basically no passive enemies. Or entities. You can't be serious. This is... This is messed up, but I lived. Yeah. I'm a sugarcane cowboy. Oh, hey, new realm. Sick.
Ooh, energy drink. Ow! Went down the way into the backrooms wiki and there's one. Yeah, there's the face. The, the... Oh, God. The, uh... The faceless. But they're like a... Kind of like a trading entity. They don't do anything else. Zoom! Ye oh, boy. Yeehaw! Ah! I don't know, I exploded. Back to level 24. Inventory going brr. Brr. Brr, brr. I miss having all my things. That's blood. I'm gonna touch the power socket. Mmm. Stick my tongue in it. Don't do that. Disclaimer. That's a bad idea. Ah, yes, a conspicuously placed elevator. How convenient. Apparently there are <clears throat> different entities on the negative levels that we have not seen. That interests me because I'm starting to get a bit, like I don't dislike the entities that we have, but like, They get a bit a little a little bit re repetitive, don't they? Back off. At this point, death moths are more annoying than anything. I'll keep going this way. Are the entities in the negative levels worse? I don't know. I've never been on a negative level. That's something I will probably investigate later. <clears throat> How's the audio, by the way? Am I too quiet compared to the game? Or am I too loud? I'm always nervous about my audio level. But I don't know. So many worms. Ewy gooey. Gummy worms. What if the worm bleeds gummy worms? Hmm. Gummy blood. It's perfect. Awesome. I'm always worried that it's too loud or I'm too loud or this is too quiet or I'm too loud or anything like that. Hello? Why does this happen? Depends if you scream. Was that too loud? Yeah, he was pretty good, actually. Sick. Still got a green tint, but at this point I have can basically confirmed that this is a result of the capture card. Oh my god, I did not realize I was being followed. Repeaters was was the scream too loud? I can try to bump up my condenser if that was actually like deafening or painful. Alright, they're right on top of me. I gotta move. 
Skidoodle, skidoodle. Do not touch my noodle. It wasn't painful. Was it too loud? Sorry for all the questions. I get nervous about this type of stuff because I can't hear it until it's done. All I can do is keep an eye on the, the audio levels on OBS. And hope that they're okay. Shadow guy? Oh, hey, shadow guy. Excuse me, I need a book. Checking this out. I will not be returning it. You cannot make me. Help, I'm... I'm panicking. Sheesh. Whoa, hey. What? Oh no, I got turned around. <gasps> ah! Sorry, the cords on my desk are all mixed up, so I was trying to rearrange them while I was walking and I accidentally went. <laughs> yeah, my, 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 my mouse. You know what I mean. Sensitivity going crazy. I literally like, <laughs> like, yet went yeet on the cord. Get down. Duck that. Omega Lul. I hear them. They're coming for me. Well, joke's on them. I'm coming for them. Oh, hey, this room. You'd like to be me, wouldn't me? God, I need to watch it. <laughs> Xavier Renegade Angel again. That show is wild, man. Oh, great, dead end. Nuclear launch detected. Nerd detected. Nerd spotted. Oh, Bob! No, another Bob! Death Moth! Run! Dead end. But it won't be my end! <laughs> yeah, you can't give me. <laughs> I'm too slippery, and your ankles are too rusty. Where's Jerry? I think he got taken to the pet store. I'm trying to find him. Has anybody seen my bird? He's about yay high. Oh, hi. Chasing the mouse, probably. I did not realize I was so hard. Hurry. Ow, way, boo, boo. Bah. Keep your eye open for any wisps. We will use them to escape this realm. Death Stand up. Ah, uh, the glitch man. What's your name? My name is Alan. Ignore the glitch guy. He wants to send me back to the previous level. By force. What? What? Huh? I think this thing is haunted. <gasps> Wisp! Oh my god. Bob! No! Don't you dare! Back off! Stay back! The wisp went this way! Death Moth! Don't... Slow... Death... <gasps> Freedom! No! 
Let me go! I made it. Yeah! Oh! Oh, once. Oh. I'm okay. Ugh. I'm all better. The arcade level. Yeah, let's play a game. Fireball! I love this one. I believe I've already stated this, but the kind of fidelity of these levels really does remind me of uh, Presentable Liberty. Which is the game maybe I'll play it sometime, but the whole point of that game is the experience, and I've already experienced it. I don't know if I could... I don't know. Great! Ah, I was, I was trying to talk about the other game, and I died to this game. Anyway, let's spend more money. Oh, great. Hit! 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 Ah! Dang. Wait a minute. I didn't spend any books. I can play the games for free here. Let's go! I figured that out. Two light jumps, not a big jump. Yes! Look at me, Mom! I'm jumping! Woo! I'm alive! Are there any other games? There's a red one. Is the blue one still fireball? Still fireball. Okay, so the colors are... The games are limited by color. All right, what's the red? Snake! I love Snake. Oh boy, that's a rough one, but I did it. Five, seven, eight, nine, ten. We got this. Twelve, thirteen. I'm a gamer. Trust me. Halfway there. Heck. Woo! Are you? <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> That's cheating. This game cheated! You swore. I'm sorry. Please forgive me. How will I preserve my image as a nice, clean YouTuber now? <clears throat> YouTube, do not ban me, please. <laughs> but you saw, that game cheated me. I like this level. Ooh, what is this? Oh, it's just a different wall pattern, I suppose. Is there something in the middle? Nope, it's just a little bit of a star area. 
I remember when I was a little youngin. I used to have those glow in the dark, like stars that you'd stick on your roof or your ceiling. And I'd put them everywhere. No entities. So far, we haven't run into any. Doesn't mean that there aren't any. But we haven't seen them. It's good. Yeah! Means we can just kind of relax. And jam out to the music. Always wanted those. They were, they were fun. And then when I went to college, I found them in my dorm room because someone put them up on the ceiling. And they just kind of stayed there. They're so expensive now. They used to be apparent, like really cheap because I did not have a, <laughs> what you would call a well-off family. So they were very cheap at the time. Was that an unclean loop I heard? Tisk, tisk, you could do better. This music is a bop though. Only three, whoa! I'm gonna say only three games, but I'm going to immediately press cancel on that flip. Isn't there like a, a guy that's supposed to take care of this place? Oh, whoa, what's this? Is this what they mean when they say the pool rooms? I have no idea how to play pool. <laughs> or billiards if you're a nerd. Imagine Nate being named Billiard. I don't see a pool table. You could play pool on this, probably. The cool rooms. The fool rooms. That's where I live. The school rooms. Da 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 They're the worst rooms, the school rooms. Uh oh, what is, what is this? By God, I've gotten pixel. I'm alive. Gotta go. Have a good day, Riley Kip. Thanks for stopping by. How retro. By God. I turned. M Asteroid is the name of the game I was thinking of. There's also a tank, tank commander. Yes, tank commander. I remember now. The wisp is going this way, so the exit's got to be like over here, right? No, oh, darn wisp. Yeah, the wisp is going to ruin your grand time at the arcade. If I can figure out which way it was going. Do 
Do do do do do do do do do Hmm, I think I misjudged which direction the wisp was going. Dun 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 uh oh Wispy come back You can blame it all on me I was wrong And I don't know the rest of the song I've never actually heard that song <laughs> Baby, come back! And I was like, baby, 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 oh, like, baby, 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 oh! Baby, 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 oh! Wish you always be mine, mine! You shall not! Pause! Copyright. Ah. Beaver, please! Put the shotgun down! No! I don't know if my hitting the desk was a convincing getting shot sound, but there you go. Justin Beaver shows up personally to put you in the ground. I believe this is the way I came from. Gandalf said that. And I think he knows a little bit more about magic than you do, pal. Oh. This is where I'm supposed to go. I guess the goal is just to go as fast as possible. No, I saw the yellow army arcade machine. I didn't. I wish I had. I guess the point is to not get caught as the as the screen rolls up and to go as far down as possible is my assumption you passed it too quick that's true <clears throat> I am not very attentive I do tend to walk by things There we go. <laughs> I reached rank A, sick. Hey, level 26. Wait, this is the paint room, the painting rooms. I remember this. It's okay now. Yeah, I tried to mute before I sneezed and I failed. And the sneeze, when I sneezed, I grabbed the, uh, the scroll bar for my audio <laughs> and lowered it down to minus 21. Imagine if you sucked at that game in particular. That'd be embarrassing. Oh, my. Inventory's too full. You don't know that. So I remember reading this one before it got deleted. This is the one where like 
It works off. What was that? It works off Mario 64 level, like, like rules. We're supposed to be able to jump into these paintings and go to that place. This isn't a trap. Told you. But I guess I guess the paintings are just for aesthetic here. Cause like I can't go into any of these. Do do doodle 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 do. I'm funny that the person is capable of meditating in the back rooms. I wish I I can't even meditate in real life. Also, how are you, seven 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 Ice Kitsune? Don't sing any song because YouTube copyrights it, even if you sing it. Sometimes doesn't always work. Things are never 100%. Besides, I'm not really worried about monetization more than I am getting blocked, which is relatively rare. <clears throat> like I make basically no money on my videos. It's not worth, <laughs> not worth carrying. Karen, if I don't, if I get demonetized, if it's too many ads and I hate that. <gasps> YouTube ads are actually really manageable. It all depends on how many the, the video maker puts on them. It's like, you want to have a bad ad experience? Go to Twitch. You'll you'll learn what a bad ad experience looks like. Doing fine, just asking a community of a niche game about lore stuff and unused game stuff related questions. Sounds like a great time. Huh? Am I shrinking? Oh my! Whoa! Ceiling jump scare. <laughs> Let's say, am I in the infinite IKEA? That was a fun game. Got 13 ad twi ads in a row and you can't skip them either. You can skip on YouTube. You cannot skip on Twitch. Ceiling was just sneezing. Like me. Mario. Don't mind it, I'm minded. Surely the way out is one of these paintings. What the? Jump in. Okay, it's not a thing. Yeehaw! Can't catch me. I'm too. <gasps> Yes, Ow! I'm okay. Ooh. We're stated to a stuff for a game for a PS1 that is physically worth two to three hundred dollars for the first game and twelve hundred for the second. Ow! Ow! That's an expensive game. Ow, my body. Ow! I'm not playing this game again. What game are you asking about? <laughs> you think? This is those red rooms people talked about back then? I guess so. Does that mean we beat, we beat welcome to the game? No, oh, good. Now that is a, that is an expert troll. Back to level zero for you, nerd. Toomba for the PlayStation 1. I've never heard of it.
I only had a few games for the PlayStation 1, and I feel like they were all pretty mainstream. Because it's, like, what came with it. What's it about? If you don't mind sharing. Oh, that's a pretty painting. Weird. Some of these paintings are very strange. You try having some relaxing music in the background. Well, there's kind of music in this level. <laughs> but I could provide music. Wah, wah, wah. Wah, wah, wah. Wah, 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 wah. Hey, a new zone. Is that relaxing? He geared cavemen like kid that didn't have parents and was raised by his grandfather and his grandfather's bracelet that was passed down to him after the death stolen by evil pigs that collect gold to increase their magic powers. So it sounds like a collectathon. <clears throat> My frozen time! Oh god, they're coming! To kick my ass! Box! Out of the box! It's a platformer RPG adventure game. Interesting! <clears throat> I'm surprised I've never heard of it. Painting! Hmm. Not this way. Not this way. No. No, not this way. Not that way. No. No, not that way. Created by a guy named Tokuro Fujiwara. Hmm. Was it a local release in Japan, or did it get international? Hmm. Interesting. Wait a minute. International. <gasps> Ahem. Sorry, Blobbert was right on me. I may have panicked a little bit. So it was big enough to get translated. Yeah, I used to work at Capcom back in the day. So like, did he get translated uh, through Capcom? Oh, hey. It's a couple faceless. Oh, I wish I didn't have a face. Faces are cringe. Imagine having a visage, a visage. Couldn't be me. Wouldn't be me. Definitely isn't me. 
quit and tried to start his own company called Whoopi Camp. Now that's a name. Whoopi! Camp. Ugh. Stretch my back. Stretch my back out. Try me. Buy me, coward. You won't. No, I well, you won't, because I'm gone. Zoom. Oh. He's still coming. Run away. Stay back, Bobbert. Blubbert. Oh, hey, he's the glitch man. He wants to send me to the other level. But I won't do that. Definitely not. Program Street Fighter 2 Special Edition created ghouls and goblins and helped produce the Mega Man franchise and Resident Evil games. Oh my god. That guy was very, very productive. Prolific. That's the word I was looking for. Jeez. What a guy. Hello? Ah, there he is. Hey, Blobbert. Fancy meeting you here, buddy. I thought I'd seen the last of you, but I haven't. You're still there. Hmm, battery. Chad. He's a gaming Chad. Me when I eat an entire handful of sugar. What? I literally become monkey. I literally become monkey. Game's quests, the game's calls, events were very weird and balls off the walls silly. What, you mean to tell me the game about a pink haired caveman? Fighting evil pigs did not take itself seriously? What? No. Ignore that. Ignore the demonic breathing. It's not a threat. <clears throat> oh boy. Hey, Bob. It's weirder than that at times. Oh my. Oh, bye ceiling. Bye bye. Does it get like Lisa weird? If you know what I mean? Or is it like, I like. Like you are Kanoko weird. Now I've got Lisa songs stuck in my head. One is using a butt-shaped peach flower to fart on an evil pig to shrink it to a tiny baby pig to trade to a person in a village part of a trade for a golden item. <clears throat> well, that's definitely a phrase that was just uttered. Huh. <laughs> Ha 
I do not know how to leave this floor. I thought it was paintings, but I guess not. I really don't know a lot to do. Luckily, there's not that many entities. Told, told you it was weirder than the story premise. That's, that's a thing. The shadow men are approaching. Slowly. Here the exit would be one of these paintings because it's like the gimmick of this level. That's me in my goose form. Honk honk. I am goose. Ain't my fault. Nobody about me view. Dude, I'll do my caboose, cause this cruise is getting real Zelda. So a motocross race using wine from a village's lake to power the motorbike So you can make a good time to get medals from a mermaid at the end Well that just sounds like how you Like how you race I thought everyone raced drunk Hmm Oh, bye ceiling. Wave bye bye chat. Bye. Ah. Ah. Hit. Ha. Hit. Hit. Oh. Oh. I could be a, I could be Link. I bet I'd make a good Link. You know what? I don't think I've actually shown you guys what this dude does on the actual since I started streaming again. Hmm. So a dog that you raise by doing a Vince style peel it from its injuries and it grows up to be able to fly with its dumbo sized floppy ears. But like Pluto. Hello. Hi. Ah! Ow! My skin is bubbling! Ah! Wisp! Let me out! I'm melting! I lived. Ah. Welcome to the sauna, I suppose. So that's what that guy does. He screams at you and then tries to make your skin melt ah that's a worm and that's a shadow folk turns out this is another entity run away from level awesome hmm Phallic demon. Is that a wolf howling in the distance? There's someone else out there. Someone running. Hey, I got super battery.
I'll be honest, I much prefer like the gimmick levels or the wide open levels over these. Um, just run from entity in a closed space type level. It's like there's a lot of these. Oh, dead end. Oh, it's not gonna be mine though. Can't catch me, dork. You're too slow. Gas, gas, gas. Gotta step on the gas. Ba -da 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 Personally say that Tumba was a very fun game. It sounds like a fun game. It sounds like a goofy time. Like that, uh, one ninja game. Hey. Like Goemon, I think it's called. Or it's like a goofy ninja. Oh, hey, it's definitely the exit. Oh, hey, it's still the exit. I'm gonna grab it. <laughs> Thought you could get me with your mouse trap. Oh my God, there's so many. Oh, I've come, I've come to the wrong neighborhood, I see. Let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out, let me out. RUN! Howdy. Second games, evil pig fights actually give you their robes that will use some of the evil pig magic and like, in Mega Man stuff. Hmm. So you can become a pig wizard. Oinkamancy. Pig magic. Duck. Duck and dive. You won't take me alive. Keep your head on a swivel and your mouth full of spittle. Just keep walking. Just get the robes, but I like the evil ice pig robe because it turns some enemies into popsicles as if they were polymorphed into them. So it literally just turns them to ice. Oh my God. Now that's cruel and unusual. But it's funny, so it'll slide. I am suddenly very tired. You know what? Ugh. We haven't gone in here this entire playthrough yet. Y'all want to go say hello? Welcome to the party realm. Dude. Do, 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 do. Ghost pig robe lets you take enemy souls and restore your health depending on how many there were. I wish I could steal souls and replenish health based on how many there were. I saw that. Stop. Stop. 
that a Minecraft character? Oh my god, it's Sanic! It's a buff bird. That's definitely VeggieTales. Oh my god, Shadow. What the? We can party some other time. No more fun. I don't know, it's looking like a lot of fun so far. That's Bang Bib! Is that Carol Weezer? Bang Bib, Carol Weezer, Sanic, Diminutheran, Donut Digger? Oh my god. What's up? Having a party, I see. Indeed, indeed. It's just me and this guy right now. How are you, Jonathan Jack Goodman? I decided to pay the, the fun house a visit. Bum, bum, bum. I think I win. Wait, are there two Carl Weezers? This is a different painting. Very well, my brother. I'm glad you're doing well. Unless this isn't Carl Weezer. Who's that supposed to be? I do know. <laughs> Yippee! Oh, this is a <laughs> great hallway. I I think I win. I just find my way out now. See Mario and Kirby. Is it Mario? <gasps> no, 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 no. Blobbert! Stay back. Uh, do, 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 Get out of my way. Don't you touch me. You freaks. Be backing up. Beep, 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 beep. But on the sanity. <gasps> this is a problem. I'm having problems. Ba 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 ba. I'm gonna sing that at the next party I go to. I'm sure they'll appreciate it. I got a mute. All right, sorry about that. Phone calls over though, but sheesh, this guy is relentless. <laughs> is this the fun level? Yeah, we're having fun right now. Can't you tell? Um, um. I'm more worried about Cowboy Woody. Ow! Stay over there. Stay back. Sus. 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 I hate confetti! Um, uh, 
Boom, boom, boom. Uh, wait a minute. I got caught on the wall. I see you. Getting chased by a blood, cl a wall clipping blood fight. Different for sure. Yeah, that's Blobbert. He's chill, mostly. He never leaves me alone, though. The blocky drawing is supposed to be a reference to uh, the YouTuber. I don't know. I don't remember his name. But I think I know who you're talking about. We found Toad yet? I'm being chased by several Toads. If you hear the thumping sound, that's Toad. He was on beat there for a second. That was creepy. Go is Jorg. What is this supposed to be? A goose to puss. Da ba 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 do 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 do. This is DMT, maybe. Wasn't invited to the Mario party. Who wants to be invited to the Mario party, if we're being honest? Hmm. Gustapus. Seriously? Why? What I do? This room is empty. Hey yo, this shit empty. Yeet. Stop following me. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. Stop. <laughs> I've beaten this level before. I know it can be done. You won't catch me. You won't catch me. I guess this is technically the way out in it. Well, anyway. I am not going back to level 3. I'm going back to level 27. So that's level fun. Nice. Yeah, back to level three. Woo! Here we go, here we go, here we go again. Stop spooking me! It's scary. Shadow people! Ah! The void! It beckons! There he is. Always the smilers. They love me. They love to cause me problems. Many, many problems. Just trying to give kisses with Thieve. What do you think, like, a... French kiss, but with teeth would look like Like you don't use your tongue. It's your teeth And it's just two people like rubbing like their teeth together Like you open your mouth and like one person has like their lower teeth like extended and the other person takes their top teeth and they like Like go Like some sort of fucked up xylophone with their top teeth on the bottom teeth You think that'd be hot? Probably like a bird packing, maybe. I'm 
I'm just imagining like that cartoon like skeleton playing his rib sounds like the Made my wife's teeth hurt with that thought. <laughs> You're welcome. I love goofy cartoon skeletons. They're the best thing about Halloween. If I could ever remember when Halloween is, I always forget that it's happening. And then I go home and there's a bunch of candy in my house. And I'm like, why is all this candy in my house? And I'm like, because it was for the trick-or-treaters. Like, what the hell is a trick-or-treater? Never been there. Trick-or-treatland. It's like Iceland, except the floor is sticky. Love you, dude. Aw, jeez. Aw, man. Making me blush. I found another pillar realm. I love when we find pillar realms. I love pillars. I accidentally used a healing item. How many monsters demanding sacrifices, right? Be thinking about the images of someone using toenail clippers on their teeth and then biting into ice cream. That's true. You could be thinking about that. I have a hole in one of my teeth. I I was um fixing a dog collar that had come loose and I had to like seal the metal back together. So I bit it to like close it because you know your jaw is like super strong and it worked until the metal on one side of the ring slipped and carved up my up one of my teeth. And like took a, like, gutter out of it. Now I have, like, a giant gash in one of my teeth, where, like... Like, imagine your tooth is, like, a... like a big box of ice cream, and you just take, like, an ice cream scoop and, like, run the ice cream scoop through it. And that's basically what happened to my tooth. It sucked. <laughs> Almost as bad as pulling on an exposed nerve. Oh. Do not pull on the spaghetti that comes out of your arm. Don't do it. My wisdom teeth shattered. Never reach my wisdom teeth because they were just enough of an angle to not be able to be brushed. Ugh. That'd be fun when you eat ice cream. Well, it like healed over. Like it doesn't hurt or anything. It just he it healed over and it's just like another part of the tooth now. I don't know if I have wisdom teeth. Personally, I've never encountered any issues. I'm gonna throw away a couple books. Who needs literature? But I'm like woefully uninjured. Like, like a lot of people have like tons of stories to tell about like crazy injuries they got. And I'm like, I jumped, I, I jumped off a, a merry-go-round where I was going and I didn't have no shoes on and I broke my toe. And uh, then I, I, uh, I was walking on the playground and I got kicked in the head and I don't remember what happened because I got kicked in the head so hard I passed out. 
There was another time where I jump off the table and I land on my head and I had to go to hospital. And I almost made the hospital believe that my mom was a, was a domestic abuser because I refused to tell them what happened because I thought it because I felt stupid for doing it. I should save. Hello? Oh my god, I just missed you. That's the glitch guy that sends you back a level. Not dealing with that. Forty and all those old breaks hurt at the same time. Oh. Every injury you've ever had still hurting. Dang. That would suck. Like the worst thing I've got is I've got like a huge scar on the side of my eye because someone threw a, basically threw a window at me in college and it cut open the side of my face. Oh, there's also this one time where my dad was doing electric work when I was like, like in fourth grade. He was doing electric work in the in the bathroom and he left the flat like the light bulb outlet like the light bulb fixture on the floor with the light bulb still in it and I stepped out of the bathtub with my feet wet and I stepped on the light bulb and the bulb didn't shatter I, sl I slipped on it like a cartoon banana peel and I landed with the side of my leg on the light fixture the metal part and it carved out a huge chunk of flesh. And it was one of those weird cuts. Whoa, what the? Color swap. But like, um, it didn't, it, it didn't hurt and it didn't bleed. And I looked at it and I was like, that's crazy. And then I stood up and did a uh, the for those previous statements stopped being true <laughs> still have a scar from that context for the window oh it was at uh, it was at college um someone had been shooting the windows at the cafeteria with a a bb gun and there were holes all through them, so the windows, the structure was super weak. And one night I was, I was going from the cafeteria, I was taking my dishes up to go get, to run them back to the, to the dishwasher so they could get cleaned. And this, this one guy was on the outside of the window and he's someone that I was kind of rude to at one point because, um, I had no sense of like social etiquette and he decided to scare me by smacking the window and it shattered and a huge chunk and huge chunks of glass like the entire window shattered and huge chunks of glass flew at me and one of them hit right the side of my eye and cut it open. I was bleeding everywhere. It scared everyone around me and I thought it was very funny. So I went to the hospital and they glued my eye together. One time I accidentally got hit over the head by a piece of scaffolding that fell from 20 feet above me. But dent in my head from it. Oh my God. You know, he felt like shit. Oh yeah, probably because he also almost seriously hurt himself because I looked over because I was like commas can be I just like whatever I look over and he has his hands caught on like the the frame of the window because that's how bad it was broken like you could touch the frame of the window and right in between his hands was a triangular piece of glass that was like an inch away from his chest 
and if he had not caught himself, he would have stabbed himself with a huge chunk of glass. So in the end, I'd say he was the one that was lucky. That's why I didn't really bother doing anything about it. It was like, like if, if this messed up, that guy could have been actually seriously hurt. Action time couldn't be better because I used both my hands to cover my head. Didn't feel the pain of my fingers because of the injury to my head. Well, there's that little upside, I suppose. Glad to living boring life. Other than that, like I've lived a pretty boring life. I don't do anything, I don't go anywhere, I don't talk to anybody. Nothing happens to me anymore. Why are there so many fun doors? Two weeks ago I had injuries to my eyes, oh my god. Bro, are you okay? <laughs> you're boring. I sit all around all day watching you. Hey, at least you're watching something. I barely do that. <laughs> ah! Audio glitch! Ah! Whoa! Crazy, wacky audio issues. I think we go for like another 10 minutes and then I'm skipping to the next level. Let me out of here. Further through a water balloon and hit my right eye hard enough to make me see colors for a few seconds like a kaleidoscope. Oh my God. Worst I ever got was a concussion. That sounds insane. Is your vision all right? Gotta love siblings, yeah. Especially when you're the older, older one and you treat get you get to treat them like garbage. Haha! -ha, I was a terrible older sibling. Why are there so many fun doors? I'm not going back to the party, you hear me? I don't care how many birthdays you have. Palette swap. A few days later, my brother tried to throw a body armor sports drink at my torso, hit my left eye hard enough to make everything darker for left eye. And it was bruised and swollen. Oh my god. <laughs> it's fine now, but goddamn, did it hurt. Yeah, that sounds super rough. Jeez. Worst I ever got was almost a stick in the eye. Wait, no, I did get poked in the eye once with someone's fingernail. They like stabbed me in the eye with their fingernail and I had to take eye drops for like a week. That's the worst that's ever happened to me. That's uh, that sounds, those sound worse. If I'm being honest. Keep an eye <laughs> on your vision. What y'all looking at? 
You ain't never seen a person eat a battery before? Nice, that's what I wanted. Give me some sugar. And had something hit me in the eye that hard since I had a high school bully throw books at me, told the PE teacher about it, and got orbital blowout from the constant punches to my eye. Holy shit. Bro, you good? I can't get in there. I can't get in there. Demons are coming. I was on the football team and was literally off his meds. Holy shit. Take care of your eyes, brother. Oh, it's what? Invest in goggles. Safety goggles sounds like. Jeez. Uh, yawn. I'm not bored. I'm tired. Don't worry about it. Same thing. Is there even a way out of this level? What if there isn't? What if you're supposed to go to level fun and that's the way out? As a kid, I used to play my grandfather's wood shop and wanted to be a carpenter and ended up messing with one of his old fashioned nail guns. Oh no. the breathing it's creepy relaxing also i'm just randomly fatigued it just happens i'll stop being tired in like 20 minutes don't worry about it i'm following me Jeez, every time i turn around there was always someone following me down the street sure it's a, the only sidewalk in the entire road but come on man Show a little etiquette, show a little class. Don't follow right behind my ass. These monsters need therapy. Men will literally become entities and creatures in the back rooms rather than go to therapy. And I'm nailing my feet to the concrete floor. What the hell kind of nail gun can nail you into concrete? Ooh, a picture. Hmm. Good. <gasps> ah. Old ones. Holy shit. <laughs> it's Blobbert! The Blobbert comes! I don't know what he's actually called, but that's his name. Older ones that were made before the safety mechanisms, mechanisms were installed in all of the newer ones. But like, that's crazy. Blobbert, the blood fart of ages! 
the storied champion. I feel like I'm interrupting. Give me the, give me some sugar. <gasps> Gotta go. What the? Oh my God. We still have the old ones and they still work. Yeah, but they sound terrifying. Ah, I'm in prison. Finally, the police have come for me for my terrible sense of humor. And my la- or so- or so for the- Yep. yep. Mm-hmm. Well said. <laughs> but out yet yeah, in and down. What is up anyway? You can up shooting one to your head or eyes if you're not careful. So be careful, duck. That moth ain't gonna catch me. Oh, hi. That lad was right up on me. Oh. What the? Stop, 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 stop. Duck! Bro, this is messed up, this is messed up, this is messed up. Let me out! Let me out! No, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god, dude. You know what this calls for? Ow! Screw you guys! Might be a switch somewhere. I don't see anything. It opened! This is getting bad. I'm s- uh, I'm free! Going this way. Screw you guys. Oh no. Ah. Yep. Ah. Stay away from me. Stop trying to get me. I want that. Me that box. Box? Yeah, I got the box. Yeehaw! I'm the 2000 calorie cowboy. I'm here to steal your sugar. Uh oh. They got put in the slammer. Uh oh. I seem to be trapped. Jeez, it's been a while. Indeed it has, George. How are you today? I'm in prison for my terrible sense of oh, humor. The whole gang was in that hall. How you doing, Alan? I'm doing okay. Had a little micro, ooh, video game. Had a little micro nerve headache earlier, but that's okay. I lost. Doing very great. That's good to hear. Blob it. Stay back, blob it. I'm out of sugar, blob it. Thanks, you neighbor. Slash me, thanks you. I'm thanking you. I 
wonder what it feels like to be a blob. I'm busy with driver's license shit. Ah. Becoming a driver. Well, that sounds like great fun. I hear a terrain. Finally, I hope you got this. I believe in your power. And the doors are all shut again. Sick. Got through the first theoretical exam. Nice. A six pack and eat a bunch of candy. You know what it is to be a blob. I mean, I'm getting there. And I don't even need to drink alcohol. I just have to ambiently exist in a household that refuses to eat anything other than meat. Ugh. Tried to hit me with a double moth. I'll stay ducked forever. Maybe I am a blob. Hmm. Blob life. Keto diet. Yeah, they're keto. They tried to do carnivore for a while. And there's like nothing but steak and like sausage in the house. And it is not doing... It's not really fantastic for my weight. I want to eat like chicken, rice, potato stuff. Like chicken, rice, potato, celery, carrot. I want that. But instead, it's have another steak. <laughs> and they're in charge. They're the people that are in charge of getting food into the into the house. So, ah, uh, really for me. I'm actually going to bed for once. Oh my god. Look at you actually doing something that's healthy for yourself. Thanks for stopping by, George, but have a good night. Moth. Ow! Yoit. Get juked on, nerd. That was fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> nope. <clears throat> Die. Uh, do the cowboy day. Black coffee, cigarettes, jerky, and a vague, unending rage. Hmm, that does sound healthy. Ah, yes, right off the bat, we're off to a good start. Personally love going carnivore myself, but yeah. Well, I, there's also a double problem in that I have, um, really bad, like, acid reflux stuff, and meat makes it worse. Don't it? Yeah. I can live the John Wayne lifestyle. There's certainly no problem there. The rage increases your stomach acid stuff. Oh, man. Next, you'll tell me that being stressed and sad all the time isn't healthy for that either. Oh, the doors are closed. I can always take some Tums. If only Tums didn't give me heartburn. Ha <laughs> ha. Tums give me heartburn. Pepto Bismol gives me heartburn. The like super, the super powered anti heartburn stuff makes it gives me heartburn. Water gives me heartburn. The only thing that stops it is Fomatidine. 
Stress can cause ulcers in your stomach. True. They approach. My problem is likely not ulcers though. I have a fit a family history of um Uh, but the, the have like gallbladder issues. Oh my god, a third moth? I wasn't expecting the third. Breathing gives me heartburn. It'd be like that, don't it? Oh my god. I take two pills for my hot burn. I take a for my uh, hey buddy. I take a for my diet in the morning, and I die somehow. I take a for my in the morning, and I take a for my in the evening, and then I don't have hot burn no more. It's just that easy. I got vapes because of my family causing stress. Eesh. A bit of baking soda and water works immediately and no side effects. Hmm. Baking soda sounds like it would probably give me heartburn. <laughs> I don't know why, but it sounds like something that would give me heartburn. Ah, hmm. Oh my god! Don't know you till you try it. I've, uh, at this point- Whoa, hey. I've concluded that basically everything will give me heartburn. Except... For, like, specific- Oh my god, they, like, instant kill. I cannot be touched. I will die instantly now. But like, if it ain't Fomatodyne, it'll probably give me heartburn. Like, that's what I've established at this point. It really works though, I'm sure it does. Moth. Just keep rolling, 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 rolling up! See? You get jumped by one nerd and you die. Oh, what's that? Uh. <laughs> you got gutted. I did get got, but I'm gonna get them more than I get got, though. Uh oh. They approach. From where? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Hello. Bye bye. Bye bye. Uh oh. <laughs> Hopefully, I didn't just get locked in. Stay back. Demon. Fiend, demon, devil. Monster conceived in the hell's blackest womb. What say you now? Death moth. Meow. Whoa, hey, Slappy. Calm down there a little bit there, big guy. Take it easy. I don't want none of that now. Friend.
Ah, uh, so that's why they call it the Slammer. I feel like I'm in the shower rooms. It's a new subset of the back rooms where it's just showers. That sounds like a concept. Someone get on putting that on the wiki. It's just a room where it's, a, it's an endless shower room. That's it. Wake up, babe. New liminal space just dropped. My battery. Uh. Uh. Um. Gotta go. Wait a minute. Oh, that's a go the other way. Let me get mushy. Sorry, you've been a source of inspiration for years, and getting to talk to you is a trip. Loving this bro, very cool. I'm, I'm glad that I could be of help, of, of help, of use in that way. What the? Satan? I gotta run as far away from here as possible. That place is haunted. Let me punch my microphone real quick. Yeah, I'm glad that I could be of use. Of use. Duck that, and we're going down the new hallway. Oh my god, it's actually a new thing. Stay back, I'm exploring here. About the SCP in back rooms alive, now I'm all about it. It, they're really great universes. I do like them quite a bit. I wonder if the exit's going to be here. Looked like a church for a second. I think it's supposed to be like a warehouse. It made me think of the skin stealer home. And shall I get one of mine out there? I'm sure it'll be great, as well. There's always room for expand- for expanding these universes. This reminded me of- I thought it was like the skin stealer outpost, but that's like level 700 or something. It's also dead now, rep. I'm pretty sure it's dead anyway, because like the backrooms fandom deleted everything. What the? <laughs> Ambush! All right, one more go and then we'll skip. We'll skip to level 29. Hello? Oh my God. Oh my god! Death Moth. You won't catch me, Bob! He's trying. He's. <gasps> you ready? You ready? You ready? <laughs> Later, sucker! Give me the thing, give me the thing, give me the thing. No, I went into the wrong cell, I won't get the thing! No! No, I can't get the thing. Juked him up hard. I snapped those ankles. He didn't stand a chance. Now he's 
sitting there curled up in the corner of a cell, crying, cradling his ankle. He's got that sad Wojak face on. Like, uh, I'll get him. I won't forget this. I'll never forgive you. And I'm just sitting here being dead. <laughs> like, bro, I'm already dead. I have no no opinion on this event. Level 29. Wait a minute. Another painting gallery. Yes, we skipped. I we skip if we spend about 30 minutes in a level. Because otherwise we'll never get through. How many painting galleries are there? I like these. I like them too, but I feel vaguely like they're AI, but I can't tell. Like maybe they're real, but I feel like sometimes they're a bit off. Spooky. Interesting. So is this the one where you're supposed to jump in the painting? Like Mario World? I don't remember which level that was. What the hell? It's a man who's so rich that light is bending around his very being. I can't see him. I'm gonna go this way. Oh my god. These paintings are huge! Ignore the audio glitch, it happens. Large, large paint! The highest evolution of Scrooge McDuck, exactly. Man's so rich that the the difference in net worth between the two of you makes it literally impossible for you to see him. Ooh, the color rooms. Welcome to the world of Gertena. Vice Gertena is an artist from XXXX. And this is his gallery. Be afraid of the paintings of women because they want to kill you in this world. Apparently Eve has a remaster. I forgot about my meditation. Eve has a remaster on Steam that I've actually been considering playing at some point. Because I really like that game. I actually really like RPG Maker games, even if they're not popular anymore. Bro, I have so many games on my wish list, so many games on my two stream category. I have so much to do, so much to see. So, what's law wrong with hitting the sandbox skip button? Because I've got 20 hours in this game, and I'm still not done. <laughs> oh my god. 
Is this supposed to be someone's desk? What is this? Hmm. Weird frog. The bear hands. A spooky bottle. Beer lamp. Oh, there are entities, Frog. True. Mushroom. Tall bat. Headless torso. Blanket. Actually, that looks more like insulation. The ass snappers are gone. Oh, God. They were waiting in the distance for me to approach, but I didn't. That guy has a large RGB lighting hallway. Welcome to the gamer zone, baby. Ah, oh, we're not we're not gaming anymore. Oh man. But I wanted to game. Let me ball. <clears throat> oh my god. Is that Maui? No. It's not Maui. Give him a hand. <laughs> you die for art, it's a worthy death that people will criticize endlessly. <laughs> <laughs> People always say you suffer for your art But what if your art is suffering? What then? Long, long man. Long. I wish I could be a long, long man. Long, long glitch guy. Go. He wants to send me to jail! Stop! You're under arrest! They either go to fine or serve your sentence. Then pay with your blood! Ha! Ha! I fought mud crabs more fearsome than you! Oh! It's the guy. It's the lad. It's the cry guy. Hey, I'm back. Welcome back, coconut. We are on level 29. Yes, level 29. Which will probably be the last level that we that we do today. Because I have to go mow some lawns. Long purple curved mostly to the left. Interesting level. I was going to make an inappropriate joke. When you get older, you'll understand the benefit of a good carve. So smuggus. You missed the sus. Person with the name I cannot read. But I'm going to call. I. How are you today? 
Ooh, I've not seen this one before. Wait. Yes, I have. Isn't this like a... That looks kind of like a cytophil or like a chloroplast or whatever. It looks like a plant cell. I wish I were a plant. I would just sit there, chill, and eat all this dirt that I could hold in my little tiny roots. I'd be a greedy plant. I'd steal all the dirt from everyone else. Hey, another cry guy. Be like, watch out, dandelion. I'm coming to steal your dirt. And then I'd steal their dirt. And then the dandelion would cry. And I would go, ha ha, sneeze. And I would blow its little seedy things away. And then it would cry even harder. And I'd be like, owned. And that, that's, that's how that entire conversation would go. You know how it is. Sad doe people. Mm, Mr. Doe Man. Ah, oh, sick! The RGB lighting is back. And it's over. Stop the rave, everyone! Oh my god, a shadow person. Where have you been all my life? What the? Big hall. Wait a minute. The painting's actually sick. I like that one. Who's knocking? I feel like there's more and more entities uh, spawning as I stay on this level. Because now there's Shadow Man. There was the hands, there's the glitch guy. I feel like there's a more. Don't forget to like the stream. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And also click on the, the, the end element. Well, you'll find more videos like this. When, like when Vegas does something Greek. Let's add some marble pillars. Now that's culture. Some marble pillars that we won't even bother to paint. Because people in 500 BC didn't know what paint was. It didn't exist. They just made everything be bland and white. Yeah, coconuts from Greece. Well, there are entities on this level, but I... Mer they're mercifully far, mercifully distant from me. Which is pretty cool. And uh, also not a whole lot of them, which is also cooler. Like one of my pet peeves is about like my historical accuracy that some nerds like to engage in. But they completely flop on painted like architecture and, and statues from antiquity. And it's like, we know for a fact that they were painted. Like, you can chemically test them and find trace. Oh, hey, cry guy, he's standing on a box. But like, you can chemically test the statues and you can figure out what colors they were. Just worn off. It's been 2,000 years. 
and then the Italians to uh, showed up and were like, we're going to be like Romans. And then they didn't add paint because they didn't know what chemical testing was. And that's why we have the uh, the image of all of that stuff being pure white. Anyway, it has been two hours. I'm going to get something to eat real quick, and then I've got to go do some IRL stuff. Ugh. Two hours, though. I really need to crank up the hours put in on these per session for these videos because... I did the math. I've already talked about this earlier in the stream. But I, that's why the statues are white. Yeah, because the, during the Renaissance, they, the Italians were trying to like, emulate like, a, like a style from antiquity, and all of the paint had worn off the statues. So they built all of their new statues white. Like unpainted. But if you go back and you test like old statues, you can, they were painted and you can see, you can, we can tell what colors they were. It's the same with buildings. Like Roman and Greek cities were very colorful. But I did the math on the videos that come out and with one a day, I have videos coming out until July. And it's going to take forever to get through anything. So I'm going, I have to, up the time I spend per part. Anyway, thank you all for hanging out. I will try to be back tomorrow. But I will see you all later. Uh-oh, there we go.